This is gonna be the first inertial ride on the bike. <laughs> kinda wanna break it in softly. This bike from the factory alone, like if we were to take this bike and leave it stock, is more than enough. Get this 131 kit, man. I'm telling you, you're, you're gonna be blown away. All right, guys, we're here at the Torque Custom Cycle Shop, picking up the bike. This is gonna be the first initial ride on the bike after doing the 131 setup. Um, this thing looks sick. It looks sick, it sounds sick. I have not yet been on the bike. This is literally my first time getting on it. Um, I was here for the dyno session and the bike just sounded crazy, man. Got some really good numbers out of it. So now in its form, the bike is doing 138 horsepower and 152 foot pounds of torque. I'll show you guys the numbers over here real quick. Um, these stock numbers. I got the dyno sheet and um, these are my stock numbers, stock dyno run compared to now. So uh, max horsepower, when we did the base run when it was fully stock before we doing the stage two was 87 uh, horsepower and 110 foot pounds of torque now it's 138 horsepower and 152 basically 153 foot pounds of torque so um 52 points higher on horsepower and about 42 points higher on torque insane I insane amount of numbers we got a lot more numbers than what Harley Davidson was advertising on the website. Obviously we switched a few things and there's the man. <laughs> so yeah, we got a lot more numbers than what Harley Davidson was advertising on the website. But once again, that's using their tuner. Uh, we used a different tuner here. That's also using their cam and uh, we're using a different cam. We'll, we'll get, we'll dive deeper into more of the, uh, of the details. What I want to do basically right now is take the bike out for you guys and kind of give you a feeling of first impressions on what the bike feels like now around town riding. Then we'll do some highway riding. Um, I'm not going to go super crazy on it. Kind of want to break it in softly and, uh, well, not softly, but I just, you know, we're, we're just going to be careful with it. <laughs> Let's just... Do a walk around first as she idles. She sounds fantastic. I love the branding of the Screaming Eagle right here in the head. On this head, we got the stage four. Then we got the 131 Brandon right here. We got the Screaming Eagle engravings right there and right there. Really nice, really cool. Now this is the stage four 131 kit from Harley Davidson, guys. You don't have to buy the full motor if you don't want to. Just go with this kit, which I have right here. If you want to get this much power in your bike, comes with the cylinders, comes with the heads, comes with the throttle body, uh, it comes with the injectors, and amongst a few other good things with it, but the bike sounds great. Let's get on. Let's do our thing. Auto response right from the jump, real responsive. I don't know which way we're gonna go. The 
let's see how she does around town first. Stop and go traffic and some lights. Uh, I don't know what Mike did to the uh, throttle response, but it's a lot more responsive now. <laughs> she sounds so good. Just a simple little pull, and she wants to launch. Whoa. Okay. <laughs> Just cracking the throttle back on first or second gear, and it's. She wants to launch off. Now, what I also want to answer in this video is, is this too much bike now? Is it too much power? And that's why I kind of wanted to go around, do around uh, town riding first. Just try it out. And a little highway riding. Sometimes we have a bike that's just packing a, a tremendous amount of power. The bike is just not rideable and fun around town. I do a, a lot of riding around towns and um, a lot of riding like this. So I still want the bike to be enjoyable and rideable, you know? I still want this bike to be an all-around bike. As of right now, I'm happy with it. I'm, I'm just really, I'm really happy with the throttle response. Stop and go traffic, it's fine. I don't feel the bike bogging around either. Woo. Damn, that Tycon Turbo S looks sick. <laughs> Holy, if there was one amazing electric car, that I would get if I had the money, it would be that one right there. Just amazing. Love Porsches. Um, but let's get back to the bike. Um, yeah, I, I don't feel the bike bogging at all either, which is great. definitely gonna need uh i'm definitely gonna need new brakes <laughs> for sure all right so let's take her on the highway we are on first gear at the moment gonna be less traffic out but apparently nobody works on Fridays fourth gear and she's pulling strong fifth gear Didn't even 
have to downshift to uh, even gain a lot more power to keep going. Like the power is there. Still fifth gear. And it's like she wants to live at 90. She gets up there quick. Wow. And even like right now, fifth gear, we're what, 85? And I just want to show you something. Just felt it. 84, 85 right now. Back to throttle. And she just wants to go. Like you really throw the power there. Cops are out here, but that's the chance. so much power at these high RPMs the bike wants to make power up on top I mean she's a torque monster she was a torque monster already but I feel like now when it comes to the horsepower even when you're reaching those high RPMs she wants to produce more and more and more and more power and he, even at fifth gear like she just wants to pull away it's insane she's fast She's, um, she's scary fast, <laughs> I'll tell you that. And it just sucks that it's like so much traffic everywhere, because even out here, just a little hard to open her up. There's a lot of cops around this area, a lot of troopers, especially around this time, and it's just a lot of traffic, but I guess we'll wait till later on today. Oh my God, she's fun though. <laughs> A lot of fun. I thought she had a lot of power when we did the stage two. And let me tell you something. This bike from the factory alone, like if we were to take this bike and leave it stock, is more than enough more than enough power believe me what i'm telling you the 117 is insanely fun but of course we had to make the bike special we ended up doing a stage two on it with the 43 cam and the bike was phenomenal i was blown away but now after doing the stage four and converting the 117 into a 131 the bike is just a bullet it, it feels like a bullet there's so much power at any power range. The bike just feels like it wants to take off. It, it, it's just insane. The, how awesome it sounds as well. It's just great. There's one thing about these Milwaukee 8s. Stock, they sound like shit. That's the honest truth. They sound like sewing machines. But once you put a cam into one of these bikes, and once you do like a big kit like this, forget about it. The bike, it, it, it sounds insane. If you really 
want to make your bike special if you're really looking for that power and if you have the 114 or 117 Milwaukee 8 get this 131 kit man I'm telling you you're you're gonna be blown away you're gonna be blown away that, that that's that's all I can say man now like I was saying before you don't have to buy the full motor the full motor is gonna run you a lot more money um, you I, I, I don't know the price maybe seven grand or some shit six seven grand um, but this kit alone is gonna cost you a lot less and you'll be able to convert your bike into a beast I'm happy man I'm I'm blown away super happy I can't wait to put a lot more miles on this bike now I'm <laughs> if you can see my my smile right now you you, you would just know I'm gonna keep enjoying my day. It's beautiful out here in dirty Jersey, blue skies, clear skies as you can see. The temperature is just great. We're up in the high 68s, I believe. Which is a great day to ride. And that's what I'm gonna keep doing right now. I'm just gonna enjoy my basically new bike now. Um, first ride on the 131, amazing. And if you are new to the channel, if you wanna see more content like this, more information about stuff like this make sure to subscribe hit that bell button that's gonna notify you anytime i upload any type of new content Woo! And like always guys let the force be with you ride safe and enjoy the ride baby peace